All right, so this is going to be a short little tutorial of how to make a V-Force 3 reed valve or the other style for an SX-85 engine fit a G2 reed valve uh, box. So basically, you're just going to mill the inside or use a Dremel. You can see there how I opened it up to fit. This one is a stock SX-85 reed valve uh, it's made by V-Force. And you can see how it fits. All i got to do is drill those holes. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to drill those holes. So I marked out with a Sharpie where the holes are. You kind of see the little Sharpie inks there. And I'm going to start with a really small drill bit to uh, make sure I get exactly on the holes. Then I'll bump up to a bigger size. So I just wanted to use that small drill bit so I could see on this side where kind of the hole placement is because I don't want this to have to interfere with the holes. So anyway. So I got all the holes drilled and now we just check to make sure they all line up, which they do. Then we assemble it and put it back together. All right, so I'm just finishing putting my uh, intake on. Pretty simple, pretty self-explanatory. Just gotta add a little clearance. But that is how you put a V-Force 3 reed valve inside a G2 box. Um, right. So that's the stock box right there. Again, I just cut the inside a little bit and uh, made it fit. Grab my scoop here. Where'd it go? Anyway, so yeah, you can see that the, the valve's a little extra wide there, so you just got to do some trimming on the inside. Real easy to do.